Hello and welcome to the AFL Auto Blends 3D Car Creation Channel. This is the second part in texturing the Mercedes G-Wagon um, as we move to finishing off the vehicle. Um, so let's jump straight into it. So the next um, object I want to texture is this, which is the um, side mirror bracket. Um, we'll give a basic plastic to this so if I move down and look for plastic on my list there's plastic so if we click that one to get viewport shading we can see there's um, I've added a, a roughness value of 0.5 um, and it gives us that texture so that's that's looking good so we'll hide that um, at this point in time, um, if you're new to the channel, could you please subscribe um, and like? Um, and there'll be far more content on modelling cars. Okay, so the next, um, next object to have this black material is this. It's plastic, so we'll put plastic here. and also the rear wheel tubs so put that on plastic as well and let's have a look how that um, that looks cool so we'll hide that and we'll hide that now another thing to have um, plastic is the surrounds here um, so let's go back to this so what I want to do with this is apply the plastic but I don't want it at roughness of 0.5 I want to reduce that roughness down to 0.2 now we're going to have to copy this one so copy call it plastic R.02 so that's point right plastic point two and we go down to here and we'll alter the roughness here and change it to point two okay so we've just created a new material so we'll hide that um, I've got it also here so Go down to plastic, roughness 02, this one here, plastic roughness 0 0.02, there's quite a few of them, this one here, plastic roughness, where are we, 0 0.02 here, and finally this one plastic roughness 0 0.02 let's make sure that's correct yeah so we'll hide that one we'll hide that one before we hide it let's just have a quick look before we hide the rest Yeah, that looks pretty good. That too. So we're going to hide that. Press H to hide it. Is there any others we're going to hide? Yeah, here. Hide. I think that's that's all of those. I'll go back to this view. Okay, so we're getting. Started to get through these things now. So what's next? Now the next um, thing is the uh, 
is the center inserts of this um, trim. Now that these are a white plastic which we haven't got so let's use the the black at 0.02 this one here and we'll copy it and we'll change the name to white white plastic and call that roughness 02 so what we'll do here is click on the um, click on the color Click on the base color and drag this up to to white. Um, do the same for this one. Oh, so drag this up to white. And where else have we got? We got the viewport display. And that color's already white. So I'll drag it all the way up so it's pure white. Okay, so let's have a look at this. That will show up as white, won't it? Actually, that one should be plastic black. So let's do this one plastic white so we don't lose it. So this one plastic or white plastic okay so hide that and then this one should be black so which is that one so hide that so what else do we need so these this one so that's plastic black nothing so too so that one hide that see so that should be white actually all right so white plastic and hide this one the same white plastic hide this one here is the same white plastic so this is what you have to do just go through alter you know just but methodically go through this so let's put white plastic on here and hide it excellent so the next thing is so the next thing to look at is the v8 logos and that's going to be pure chrome so if we go metal chrome so hide those and the other one is at the back so it's the G500 logo and give that metal chrome and hide that so the next um, thing we'll look at is the door handles so this one now there's two parts of this there's the actual handle itself and the um, the key, the keyhole. So let's just have a look at this. 
hard to see, isn't it? I think that's uh, more of a, a metal in there, um, but it's only in that, in the centre. Okay, so let's have a look at this, see what we can do with this. That's not a plastic, it's more of a, more of a metal. Right, okay, so the door handles, um, having looked at it, um, it is a plastic, so we will assign um, a material called plastic black point two, I think. Yeah, that one, R.02. So assign that. Um, and now we'll add in another material. Um, put in metal chrome. And what we need to do is go into edit mode. So we go in edit mode and hover over that area and press L to select that. Um, right, let's do it again. So press L and press L there. And then what we need to do is assign the metal chrome just those items okay so to get the effect of that tap back into object mode let's have a quick look now at the moment that's all crime isn't it ah. right right so i need to add the material in Let's, let's do this again. Let's go back a bit. Right. So let's just tab into that. We'll change that back to um, plastic uh, RO2. Then we'll add in the uh, metal chrome. Which is this one. Then we'll tab into edit mode. We've highlighted those two areas and we'll press assign. Now tab back into object mode. And let's have a zoom in and have a look. So that's good, yeah. Might change that at some point to uh, put a bit of roughness on that. Um, I have to think about that one. Yes, on reflection, that needs to be um, a different material. It needs to be it needs to have roughness on it. Um, so what I'm going to do is copy this. So I copy it there, and I'll change the roughness to what should we go for? Point one. So we'll just change the name of this. So change it to R01.1. Okay, so let's zoom in and have a look. It still looks very bright to me. Let's have a look. Also, that that needs to be changed. It's not. Um, move that. Right. So let's choose this again. Tab into it. Um, Just choose this one first, L. Just move that one back on the, why is it not moving? It's 
so let's do the old tage. See if there's anything there. Don't know why that won't move. Hmm, interesting. Let's turn mirror off. Move it. No. Okay, well, I'll come back to that another time. <coughs> but get it right so we don't see any gap behind, behind that. Or I could simply just grab that. Grab these, this one, so this one, this one, and this one. We've got those three. Let's move that back. No, it's not. Um, it's. I think it's to do with this. Let's take that off. Right. So let's hover over and press L. See if we. Yeah, we can move it now. <clears throat> and just move it back into place till it starts to intersect. That's better. Um, we'll do the same on the other one. That one's okay. It looked like it was just that one that was uh, not sitting in the right place. But it's all okay now. Right, okay. So that's good. So tab. So yeah, that's looking rather cool. Um, right, so the next piece. So let's hide those. So I think there's one on the tailgate. Yeah, there's another one on the tailgate. So we'll do the same thing on that one. So we'll go to the material section, add in plastic, plastic RO2. Um, we then add another material, search for the the metal chrome roughness 01, which is that one. And we tab into this, press L to hover over that, and then press assign. There we go. So press H to hide that. Um, and then where do we go? So the next bit will be these, which are the um, Rubbers are around the windows, so let's search for rubber, see if I've got rubber in there. Yeah, black rubber, that's the one. So sign that. And that also is on the back there. Albeit, I think that could be more of a plastic material back there. So what I'm going to do is add in um, plastic 002, R02, where are we, plastic R02, and tab, press L to hover over that, and press assign. Okay. So let's have a close up on that one. Yeah, that looks fine. <clears throat> and then if we zoom into this, there's our black rubber. Okay, so select those and press H to hide them. Now this one I think is a plastic <clears throat> R02. So go to plastic R02 and hide that. Excellent. 
Okay, we've got the window borders there, which I'm not sure what we're doing with. And we've got this around there. That's going to be plastic R02. And hide that. These are, this is just a matte black. <coughs> so, we'll put in the, um, we've got a material called um, Shadow Planes. So I'm going to put that in as Shadow Planes. So that should give us a, a, a black matte texture there, um, which if we look at the windscreen, let's move these across. So if we look at this one, it's, um, <clears throat> it's that black line around there. Okay, so it's a border as such beyond the windscreen. So there's that one, so press H to hide that. Let's move this one out of the way. And move this one out of the way. <clears throat> okay, so where do we go now? So where to go now? Um, Right, I'm zoom in and choose this metal black roughness O2. Right, okay. So metal black roughness O2. And the same for this metal black. So two. Okay. So let's select this as well um, and assign a metal plus metal metal plastic metal black roughness O two and that piece there. Metal black roughness O2. Um, right. So I've got the whole thing there. Um, so let's go into, let's choose this again. Choose edit mode. The These end pieces. Right, before we do that, let's choose that piece and go metal black zero two. Excellent. Now these pieces in between are rough uh, are they now? So that is right. So there'll be plastic, sorry, not uh, rubber. So if we go into edit mode of this, choose so there's the right, choose this. Hover over that. And choose, um, let's add in plastic. Plastic R2. And tab. And 
we need to go into here. I'm going to assign metal. Metal with reference node 2. Get tab into edit mode. We've got this piece as well. So metal RO2. We can always change this later if we decide otherwise. And then this piece in the middle. So tab into edit mode. Press L to hover over. Right. Let's choose that. Edit mode. Press L. So press L. Hmm. Let's go into there again, tab into edit mode, press L. For some reason that's um, hidden. Um, so let's tab into there, let's have a look. So windscreen wipers. So let's uh, move this down. Go into the greenhouse. Zero, zero, two. There's one in here that's not. No. Confusing. Windscreen, windscreen. Very strange. Well, let's tap into this again. Let's have a look. L. Ah, got it this time. So let's put this back. So let's add in plastic. Plastic R2. And tab back into right. Okay. So let's um hide that and that and that 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 that. Okay, so um, I'll do the rest in the um, in the next video. Actually, let's do this. We can do the um, shadow plane on this one. So let's do shadow plane, and then hide that. Okay, this will be um, plastic art. Two, so let's choose this one first. Let's choose them both and press Control and J to join them. So they're one item now. Um, and let's choose um, plastic. That'll be plastic R O two, and then press H to hide them. Okay, so uh, we'll move into the. We should conclude all the parts uh, in the next episode. Um, these are shadow planes here that are already pre-selected. So they're put into... Uh, so reflections don't go through, so press H. Um, so that's all we've got left, so we'll do that in the next episode. 
Okay, thank you for watching. See you in the next episode. Bye.